Hey, I'm Harold with TrickFlow TV. And one of the most frequently asked questions that we get is how to install our four corner steam line kit on your LS engine. Well, today I'm gonna to walk you through the installation of where, which fitting goes where on your Project LS. Today, I chose to use the black braided nylon hose kit just because it fits the theme of the engine. Um, I went ahead and pre-assembled all the lines just to speed things up a little bit. Um, but if you are unfamiliar with how to assemble and hose and fittings, I found a cool video from Summit Racing. Just click here and, and they can walk you through that. Uh, some basic tools that you're gonna need to assemble this. It's gonna be a 3 16 Allen wrench and a 9 16 wrench. Step one is gonna be installing the dash four steam line fittings on the four corners of the cylinder head. A important note is when you pull these out of the package, there will be a loose rubber O-ring that gets installed right here. Now that I have the four steam line fittings attached, I'm going to route the hose. Now there are many different ways that you can route them. We're going to route across and then on the passenger side of the engine for this application just because it's a cleaner look. The first fitting I'm going to attach is going to be the 90 degree female swivel coupler and this is going to go to the driver's side front steam line fitting. Next is going to be the swivel dash 4 T and that's going to go to the passenger side front. Next we're going to install the dash 4 male T to the driver side 90 degree swivel coupler. Now you'll install your two dash 4 fittings that we pre-assembled and the hose to connect the two together. To make it easy on yourself don't tighten the fittings down until the end of the process. The front of this male T is where you'll install your dash 4 straight fitting and what this will route is to your radiator, to your upper radiator hose, or to your coolant can. Next we're going to install the line that's going to run from the passenger side front to the passenger side rear. For the front connection you're going to use a 90 degree hose end fitting and you're also going to use a 90 degree fitting for the rear. Okay now that we spun the engine around this is the line that we attach to the passenger side front. You're going to install your swivel T to the passenger side rear and make sure that the straight part of the fitting faces the driver side rear fitting. Then you'll install your line from the front to attach it to the rear. Next you're going to want to install your 90 degree hose end onto the driver side rear fitting and then to make the connection to the swivel T, you'll use your dash 4 straight fitting. Now that the kit is installed, I'll go through with my 916 wrench and make sure that everything is tightened. Uh, you'll have some extra hose left over. Remember that'll go to the front of the T and then you can route that to your radiator, upper radiator hose, wherever you choose. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching TrickFlow TV.